Hi everyone, if you want to tone up those abs and grow that booty, this workout is for you. All you need is some pants and you're ready to go. Let's get started. Bird dog, get on all fours and engage your core and glutes. Make sure you're not rotating your hips. Start to raise your leg and the opposite arm up. Don't trace too high to the point your back starts to arch. Aim for a straight line from the arms, head, glutes and feet. Slowly lower your leg and arm down and switch sides. Bear crawl and shoulder tap. Start in a tabletop position. Your wrists under your shoulders and your neck aligned with your spine and raise your hips slightly to lift your knees off the floor. Keeping your core tight and hips level, lift your left hand up to touch your right shoulder. Reverse the movement to return to start, then repeat on the other side. X plank. From a high plank position, transfer your weight to your right shoulder and arm. Lift your left arm off the ground and reach towards your right foot. As you do so, you will need to raise your glutes and hips to accommodate the movement. Once you've tapped your right foot, lower your glutes and hips and place your left arm back on the floor. X crunch. Contract your core, bring your right elbow across your body and towards your left knee. Repeat for the other side. Perform each movement slowly and with intent so you can really feel this in your core. Up bikes. Raise your knees towards your chest until your shins are parallel to the floor. Engage your abs and curl the right side of your upper body off the floor to move your right elbow towards your left knee. Pause for a second while at the end of the movement while squeezing your abs and obliques. Alternate back and forth.
In and out. Keep your abs contracted to support your lower back and tuck your chin in as you lean back. Use your hands for support. Just before your shoulder blades touch the floor, stop leaning back and hold this out position. Then lift your upper body back up away from the floor and draw your knees in towards your chest to return to the in position. Marching glute bridge. While keeping your core tight and holding the bridge position, lift one foot off the ground, bringing your knee in towards your chest as if marching. Do not let your hips sag as you lift the leg. Donkey kick. Get on all fours with your hands stacked directly under shoulders and knees under hips. Make sure your back is flat and engage your core. Slowly lift your leg against the band straight back up and towards the ceiling. Your maximum height is right before your back starts to arch or your hips begin to rotate. Fire hydrant. Get into a tabletop position. Keep your belly button drawn in towards your spine, your back flat and your legs bent at 90 degrees. Slowly and controlled, lift one leg out to your side, stopping at hip height.
Clamps. Lie down on the side. Engage your abs. This will help you stay stable. Keeping your feet touching, raise your upper knee as high as you can without shifting your hips or pelvis. Don't move your lower leg off the floor. You should really feel this in the back muscles of your hips and also the side. Glute bridge and open. Place the band above your knees. Lift your hips off the floor until your knees, hips and shoulders form a straight line. Squeeze your glutes and keep your abs drawn while pushing your knees against the band as far as you can while maintaining that bridge position. Bring your knees to the original position before slowly coming back down. And that's it you guys we're done I hope that you enjoyed this workout if you do subscribe to my channel I post four workouts every single week I'll see you again soon bye